Hey, what's going on everybody? Steven Bear King here with another part to our Mario Kart 8 walkthrough. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Another great day to be here recording some Mario Kart 8 videos for you guys. So let's just go ahead and get started as soon as this game is done loading the little cutscene that you get for waiting too long in the open menu. So let's see what we got going on here. We are going to be playing some single player. We're trying to get three gold stars and all the cups that we didn't get gold stars. You can see we got them on 50cc, 100cc. We're working on 150cc. So it looks like we got some flower cup. We're going to be playing with Yoshi. I already got them all set up. As you notice, we got the multiple colors of Yoshis for pre-ordering the DLC content that you can see on the bottom of the screen there. Those are the characters being promised in the two things of DLC. But we're going to stick with the purple Yoshi because that's my favorite color Yoshi since thanks to uh, Super Mario World, the purple Yoshi when you swallow stuff would give you uh, some wings which is pretty cool. I enjoy that a lot. So we're going to check out the flower cup. We are going to try and succeed in getting three gold stars. Now I did actually practice a little bit online with this Yoshi. That's why it was already set up and ready to go from playing just the night before online for fun. Wasn't recording anything. Just online playing and uh, practicing because I don't want to have to mess up this 150cc. Hopefully I'm saying that I practice isn't going to make me just lose, but it should be alright. And I wanted to check out the multiple color Yoshis for pre-ordering the downloadable content. Once again, thanks to my dad for you know, his contribution to help keep my channel running and providing for us with things like this. straight across that little corner. And if you pay attention to the Prana Plants, you can, you know, get a little bit lower on that line right there. But I usually just stay on the middle line and not have to worry about where the Prana Plants are. If you're on that middle line, you're far enough away from them. This side doesn't have any Prana Plants, but you got to watch out for those Goombas that change position and then turn around the corners. So, a few different things to think about on this track. by now, you know what I'm saying. Oh, just go ahead and drop off that banana so the blue shell would have wrecked the banana anyways and we wouldn't have had a chance to use it. There's an item block right here. I get the boost off of that. Turn the wheel and get the boost off the point. Why not? So far, we are cruising right along. Red shells, can I get a defensive? Okay. Take a red shell. My face is causing me to miss a couple of points there, but that's fine. I really can't ask for it. I mean, super points are pretty good item in the first place, but a red shell in the first place, so you can't really prove about that. Except for when the blue shells are coming. shells in one race already, but luckily it didn't cost us our first place finish for that race, so we did quite well in that. Donkey Kong was just before us. I love that next race is the first option, and now that we just instantly are like pushing A to get through to the next race, it doesn't make us view the highlights. That's awesome. Probably never going to get over that. Never going to get over the fact that we actually got downloadable content for this game. Absolutely amazing to get. You know, I'm excited about the tracks more than anything. I'm excited about Link and Drive and Bowser, but the tracks, man. 16 new tracks. It's going to be pretty amazing. Um, I just wanted to focus on this. Just a second to get through that part where computers come too close to you. They can easily knock you off the edge of this character. And this Yoshi gets pushed around quite a bit. Other characters that he's racing with, 
grab a couple of these coins and try to catch up to the person who just passed us taking the like shortcut route. to the next race i do want to take this opportunity to thank you guys once again so much for joining me um remind you that you can go check out all the other videos on my channel the channel is just stephen bear king very simple but we have minecraft we have Elder Scrolls online a lot of good stuff on my channel so definitely go check that out after you finish this video because we're going to hop right into the next race this is one of my favorite tracks in the game too. I really love this one. It's a pretty simple track, like there's not a lot to it, but I think sometimes after all the chaos and stuff that goes on in this game, it's nice to have a couple of simple tracks. We usually think of a uh, ghost house as a simple track, but compared to some of the tracks in this game, this one's pretty simple. But I just I like it. It's probably the dude swinging the hammers at the end. Third, first place finish, which means we just 
got one more. We're making this 150cc look a lot easier than we did the first time. But I don't want to say that. I think there was a lot of the 150cc ones where we got, you know, three first place finishes and then messed it up on the on the last race. I'm pretty sure that happened multiple times. Probably the same with mirror mode. I know mirror mode gave us a lot of problems too, so definitely looking forward to getting that all taken care of. But what we got to focus on right now is this one last race. Another track that we're very familiar with. Pretty much all the tracks. On 150cc. So let's go ahead and view the results. Again, thank you guys so much for joining me. If you've made it this far in the video, definitely hit the like button if you like the video. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. If you want to just check out what things that I'm watching on YouTube and stuff like that, you can follow me on Twitter at Stephen Bear King, where a lot of the videos that I like and stuff are posted directly to Twitter. Things like that, so you can definitely go check that out. Also, if I have any, you know, inside information about things coming up to my channel that I want to share, I do that on Twitter and stuff. So you can definitely do that. But there it is, our gold trophy, which we already have, but our three gold stars, which is what we really needed. We're up to 2,800 coins. We need a, we need a lot more coins. We did get a stamp for using Yoshi, so that's good. We also been using the characters in order, trying to make sure that we get as many of the stamps as we can. I don't want to post the Beavers. They still have to change that for me, but that's cool. But that's going to do it for this video. I'll check you guys out on it.